Hello, this is Doug at the MathWorks bringing you video number 243 talking about why you would want to use image to view data that is not traditionally considered an image. So let's take a look here at what I have. This is actually a surface plot of a set of data that I'm viewing from the top. If we rotate this, you can see that we are just viewing it from the top and we're essentially throwing away all of the height data and just looking at it like this. This is a very common thing for people to do, but I believe it is inefficient. And the reason for that is MATLAB is calculating a lot of three-dimensional information and using that in the graphics and so you're using a lot of memory that you are immediately throwing away by viewing it from the top. A better way to do this is if we try image of Z, the data that we're interested in. Oops, I had gotten the data and then <laughs> didn't use it. Okay, let's run this. I'm just going to select that. That's the only part that matters. If we look here at the window again, okay, this one, um, we're saturating our colors. So instead of image, what we want to use is image scaled. And what that's going to do is, well, we'll just see here, that it is going to scale the color to what the data is. Now looking at this, this is a very similar graph to what we had in the first one but it is using a lot less memory and it doesn't draw those lines in the middle. This may be a good or a bad thing depending on what your data is. But what I found is that for extremely large data sets, those lines become distracting to the point that they obscure the data. The extra memory that's used by doing a 3D plot and then viewing it from the top is probably not significant on this 50 by 50 data set. But when you start getting into 2000 by 2000, that's when things are going to be a little bit more significant and it's better just to view the data like this. All right, so give that a try next time you're tempted to do a visualization with Surface and then just view it from the top anyway. Thank you.